I wanted to go over why you shouldn't do what the pros do. So typically I work with women who just, they're very successful in one area, whether it's their career or maybe being a mom or maybe they have money or maybe they have help, but they don't have, they don't have it all. I even work with trainers, nutritionists and all that stuff so they can build their business and attract better clients and stuff like that. And they, you know, women, they look at my body or they look at somebody and they try to do exactly what they're doing and they never, it never works out. That was one of my hangups because you know, that's what I say, find somebody that has what you want and you do what they do. But there's a gray area, just like everything else, right? So I'm a fitness model, entrepreneur, a certified energy healer. So, and y'all know this, usually our main issues, whatever the surface level issue is with health, weight, or whatever we don't like about our bodies, it's all surface level. It always, it's never the real problem. There's always something beneath the surface. And for me, when I had PCOS, um, endocrine problems, hormonal issues, cystic acne, depression, low libido, like miserable self-doubt. When I would try to pay these coaches or try to like do these plans that these other successful girls with great asses and great butts and great everything, I would try to do exactly what they did. And it only made me feel worse. It only made me feel worse about myself. I couldn't stick to it. And there was a reason why. You can follow some of the fundamentals that they do because success leaves clues. Just like if you like my body, You'll see that I lift weights. I don't run. So maybe you need to start lifting weights versus doing Orange Theory or whatever else. But you don't need to do the exact plan I'm doing. So in the paid group and when I work with my students, I'll say all the time, like, they know this. Like, I, I don't go and I won't track my food. Um, I drink alcohol. I, I, you, we, I just live life, right? My body stays looking good. So that sometimes will let them know, like, oh, I can be lax and chill about it too. No, you can't. Because you're not where I'm at. You haven't done the things that I've done to be able to do that. Like when I first started, I could only eat 1,400 calories. I was eating 1,400 calories doing two-a-day workouts. Could not get the fat off my midsection. No matter what I did, couldn't get results. Paid all the trainers, spent all the money, everything. And now I can eat well over 2,500 calories and barely work out. And still be good to go and I don't even do caffeine like I did these little energy vitamins I don't even do pre-workout now and you would back in the day I used to take Adderall and do Venti's back before that I would do probably 500 migs of caffeine a day seriously so and I go over how I got from there in like 1400 calories to 2500 and, and healed my adrenals and my thyroid I go over all that in the webinar so if you haven't watched that go watch it now caseyship.com forward slash register to register to watch it. It's no cost to you. You can watch it. If you like what you see, you can fill out an application to see which course or if Hot Moms is, you know, which, what, what can you get started on that's at least going to get you the ball rolling in the direction uh, of where you want to be. So check that out. Um, but going back to why you don't need to do things like the pros is because, like I say, you can't just jump in if you've been eating 1,200 calories and, and not sleeping and jump in. Well, Casey eats 2,500 and lifts weights, you know, 20 minutes, four days a week. I can do that too. No, you cannot. You're going to have to. Here's, here's a tip. Here's something that everybody can do no matter where you're at. If you can't stay on track, the emotional side needs to be addressed, okay? So there's a reason why things haven't worked out for you and you always fall off the wagon. It's always something emotional. You know, being a woman, we think that things have to be perfect. Things are never what they actually seem. But one thing you could do is, like, if you're just starting out, you need to know what you're eating. This is for somebody that's very beginner. If you'll just track what you eat, even if it's not even, if it's not perfect, track your be your worst days, your bad, your worst days. And if you can just become a disciplined half-ass, like, just be 50%. You don't even have to be 100. On your worst days, track it. See what you're eating. Not the food, just see how many calories, okay? And I guarantee you that you're not eating enough. So once you start tracking how much you're eating, you'll be like, I'm eating 900 calories. No wonder I can't lose weight. Because if you're not eating enough, you're in a chronic deficit. You're withdrawn, like overdrawn in your bank account. You know what I mean? Like you wouldn't keep spending money if you're overdrawn. Yet, that's what we do all the time when we don't have sleep, we're running, we're stressed out, we're caffeinated, and we're not eating enough. And a lot of women think that, oh, you eat less to lose weight, right? And wrong. It's such a lie. Such a lie. Okay, now there's also a gray area. You can't just eat, you know, Olive Garden once a day and eat crappy calories and live whatever and expect to look like a fitness model. That's, that's, come on. 
Well, that's like saying, I'm going to be a millionaire. I'm not going to do anything to do it to get that. I'm not, you know, I'm just going to sit on my butt and watch the view. That's, no, 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 no. This is, I don't even think you think like that. But start tracking your calories, even if it's on Fitness Pal. Just start figuring out how much you're eating on a daily basis. Once you have that number, now we've got something to work with. And I've got a course for this. It's called Reverse Dieting. It's on caseyship.com forward slash shop. It's phenomenal. You can get this course and turn into a fitness coach. I've had that happen. I've had girls get it. And they get such a transformation by working with us and learning what I teach in there. They get their own trainer certifications and learn how to make money with the, the transformation that they got. So go get that. That way you'll learn how to reverse diet. You'll learn how to get out of that chronic deficit that you're in. And eventually the goal is to get to at least 2,000 calories. And in that you should, you will, you will tighten up. You will tighten up. I teach you everything in that course, reverse dieting course. If you want, if you're gonna have questions along the way, then I probably recommend checking out Hot Moms because then you'll get coaching from me and you'll, you'll get a little bit, you'll move faster. But even in the reverse diet, you'll, you'll be able to get into the group. But at least you can start tracking. Just go ahead and start tracking what you're eating and aim to get to 2,000. Aim to get to 2,000, okay? You can't just jump in and do exactly what I do unless you're willing to do everything that I do. And y'all know that I handle emotional stuff. I do inner work every day. You have to address things on a soul level at the core of who we are. It That way things work out for you. Because if things aren't working out for you, there's something that you're not doing or doing that's sabotaging yourself to just stay in that cycle of things not working out. So if you're ready to end that cycle... You need to do, you need to take action. You need, and if you can't take action, then you need to just feel the fear and feel all this bullshit stories that's in your head and do it anyway. And I'm going to be doing a training tomorrow for free in this group, all about that. That's going to be a part of the course, um, esteem, uh, elevated esteem. So definitely tune in tomorrow for that. But everybody start tracking their shit. If you're a beginner, just see what you're eating. Try to get to 1,500, 1,800 to 2,000 calories. Take pictures so you know how you feel. You get more energy, whatever. What foods give you more energy? If you want our food test, go get that. That's food test success course. You know, we've got all that. So that you don't have to guess. That's what I've done for you. I've taken the 14 years of anguish and put it in something where you can get results in, in a freaking four weeks versus four years. You know what I mean? So don't try to do what you see these successful people doing if you're in a bad place because guarantee you they're not telling you everything they did I know they're not and they've done a lot to get there like you can't just jump in and do that that's like saying I want to start doing golf and I'm just going to do exactly what Tiger does dude you, you can't do that you've got to start off slow you can get inspired by the way he does things but you can't just jump in and do exactly what he does you know what I'm saying so you can't do that with these fitness models either you have to go and you have to start small, start at like day one and then you build up. But that's a great place to start is start tracking your calories, okay, and get to a point where you can eat 2,000. If you've got fear around that, then that tells me, that tells you that you've got some emotional baggage that needs to be addressed. You've got some old beliefs of that can't be true, I'll gain, I'll gain weight doing that, how do I know what to eat, you know, there's fear and all that stuff. But for those that are down for the challenge, go do it. It works every time. Um, so yeah, that's on the reverse diet and or hot mom. So caseyship.com forward slash register or caseyship.com forward slash shop. And then we got the free training in here tomorrow. Um, get in my free Facebook group. Tell your friends about it. Um, what else? What else? Yeah. Just can't do that. Y'all can't be doing what the pros do. Cause a, most of them lie to you. Most of them don't tell you what they really do. They're just trying to sell you on buying their eight week challenge. And then you're like, well, I got results, but I'm still, I still know, I'm still nowhere near internally where I want to be. That's because you haven't addressed the emotional stuff. And that's because you're trying to do a quick fix. It's like having money too, dude. Anybody that tries to make money now, like you, you've got the choice of, well, let me just stay in this job because it's paying me more and I can do X, Y, and Z versus actually going and finishing my degree or doing X, Y, and Z and X, Y, and Z. You're thinking about that quick hit. That's like, that's why, that's the definition of scarcity and poverty mindset. You can actually do them both. You can actually get your degree and work the job, but that would, that would, that would take you doing a lot of personal growth to understand why. Um, your time's not working for you because you can actually make time 
work for you and be on your side. So tons of support here, y'all. You just got to know what you want and be willing to take action to learn something new. That's all you got to do, man. That's been my secret this whole time is when I get to a place and I'm frustrated, I'm like, shit, man, who can help me? Where's the answers? Like, there's got to be somebody that can just look at, see what I'm doing and tell me where to pivot or tell me what to switch up and I can see the immediate shift. And there is. It's called mentors and it's called coaching. And based on yesterday's podcast, you can write your coaches off. You can write your, your mentoring off in this consulting because it's only going to make you a better person. You're going to show up in life better. Your whole world changes because you're a different person. You're actually happy. You're actually feeling good. And that energy is going to carry over and ripple out from you, right? So get your shit together. Um, go watch my webinar. Take action. Do something. And if, this, if, if you're a beginner and you're wanting to know why you can't lose weight, do what I just said. Go back and listen to this video and do exactly what I said. Let me know if you got any questions. If you're listening to this on a podcast or YouTube, like, subscribe, leave a positive review, and I will talk to you soon.